Rockovitz with the Clubhouse Report presented by your local Ford stores. We really have a theme going on here, Meredith, and there's a guy who hopes to get people's attention and draw some eyeballs, and that's Ruben at Odor in the lineup today. Tell us about that. Bob, Aaron Boone decided to mix things up a little bit. He was asked after the game yesterday if we would see Rugnet Odor in there today, and he said, well, there's a pretty good chance, and today he made it official. Now, the Yankees acquired Odor on Tuesday. Now he will get the start at second base. I asked him what his initial reaction was when he first found out that he had been traded to the Yankees. Um, great. Uh, I think this is a thing that... Everybody, every kid want to watch, you know, every kid want to grow up and play in this team. So when I when we find out that I get tried to this thing, I was so happy. I noticed you had to shave the beard. Was that weird for you? Yeah, uh, it, was, it was weird. Yeah. I, I feel weird. Even my daughter, she don't want to, she don't even want to look at me. <laughs> but you know what? This, it is what it is, you know. I'm happy to be here. How do you see yourself fitting into this team? Excuse me? How do you see yourself fitting into this team? Good. I mean, we got a lot of good people here, good, good personality, and I, I'm just going to come here and try to do my best to help the team to win games. Odor is actually very good friends with Yankees catcher Robinson Chirinos. He actually called Chirinos when he found out he had been traded and kind of tried to get the lay of the land. And Chirinos told him not only are there good players, there are also good people in that Yankees clubhouse, something Odor confirmed when he got there and entered at Tropicana Field. He'll be at second base today and bat six. So DJ LeMahieu will slide over to first base. Jay Bruce has the afternoon off. And Brett Gardner will get his second consecutive start in left field. I asked Aaron Boone why Gardner instead of Frazier in left this afternoon. Yeah, Frazier's good. Um, uh, just, you know, against Tampa, the value of, you know, as much as they do matching up to value to have a little balance in the lineup. Knowing we got a couple lefties coming up, obviously, uh, with, with Toronto likely. A uh, chance to get Gardy a couple days in a row. I feel like he's in a pretty good rhythm. Um, <clears throat> but, you know, Frazier will be right back in there and, and playing regularly. That, that's too straight that he sat down. Do you have to have a conversation with him? I touch base with him. Yeah, no doubt. Um, you know, nothing's changed as far as um, my expectations for him and, and the year I know he's going to go out and have.